Hey. Hello, class. Uh, sir? I think you're in the wrong classroom. No, Ida, I'm not. Aizawa and I are switching classes for a few days. Principal Nezu thought it would be a good idea to switch it up. And then he laughed. Not sure what that meant. So, does that mean Mr. Aizawa is with 1B right now? Yes, Midoriya, that is correct. <laughs> Fucking awesome. Okay. Well, on Mondays, I usually bring my class donuts. So here you go. Help yourself. <gasps> oh, my God! That is the nicest thing anyone's ever done for us! <sighs> oh, my God. What is it usually like for y'all? Good morning, you waste of space. Oh, fuck. No. Where is Vlad King? Vlad is dead. No, he's not. Well, he might as well be. Because no one's coming to save your mediocre asses. I'm gonna beat the bitch assness out of y'all. Oh no, a live grenade. <laughs> oh my god, what the fuck? Okay. So today I brought someone to help me with class. Recovery girl. Hey, guys. Hey, recovery girl. You don't fucking talk to me. Sir, I don't think I understand. Why is she here? Glad you asked. So after just one day with your class, I've noticed some very clear signs of PTSD, particularly the work-study students. So Recovery Girl is here to provide some counseling. Man, what are you talking about? We ain't got no PTSD. Ah! What was that noise? I dropped my pencil. Okay. Yeah, see that? That is not normal. Bullshit. Eraser says trauma is the key to having a fucking backbone. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. See, the reason y'all are such bitch babies is because you think life is guaranteed. Idiots! Regular devastating trauma builds character. That's why y'all are so fucking weak. You're emotionally healthy. Class 1A is mildly depressed, and you're negligent. Oh, you want to see negligence? Two live grenades. <laughs> oh my god! I'll go learn today. So, time for P.E. Um... We're just gonna go on a 15 minute run. Nothing crazy. Okay. Then what? Um, well, I guess we could play a game or something. Like capture the flag, kickball. <laughs> Weak! Shut up. Okay, sir. What do we do after that? Um, I don't know. Stretch or something. What do you guys usually do? Ah! Where the fuck are we? Are we even on campus? Oh, hell no! I am too pretty for this shit. That's what I thought your bitch ass would say. Is this a radio? Wow. You are so perceptive. You have one thing to do for P.E. Make it back to campus before lunchtime. And maybe I'll allow you to eat. You drove us here. That sounds like a you problem. I'm sure one of you can fly or something. Figure it out. Also, you're in a live minefield. <laughs> Good luck. Uh, uh, what the fuck? <laughs> huh. This Merlot is fucking fabulous. And time! Woo! Good job, everyone! Woo, yeah! I think that's the fastest we've ever done any training exercise. Fast as y'all done? I think you set a school record. God damn! Yeah, even Kaminari finished on time. Huh? The fuck you mean, even Kaminari? Man, shut up! Battery pack? Yeah, you're right. <clears throat> Listen, this exercise is fucking weak. Of course it's gonna be easier if most of the fucking obstacles are gone. There are no other obstacles. Um... What? This is a very straightforward mock rescue mission. What other obstacles are you talking about? Okay, it's a very simple rescue mission. All you have to do is get in and get out. Even you failures can handle that. Oh, okay. We've totally done this before. We got it in the bag. Let's go, guys. <laughs> and collapse ceiling. <laughs> Set third floor on fire. Flood the first. <laughs> My fucking god! And just for fun, live grenade. <laughs> huh. Good morning. Uh, is it? It's eight in the morning. Anyway, how are things going with my class? I'd say it's going pretty well, considering the amount of bitch assness I have to reverse. Way to set those kids up for failure. You mean not dropping buildings on them every week? I'm confused. If you're not dropping buildings on my kids, what the fuck are you doing? Oh, you know, providing a safe learning environment, undoing the effects of all the trauma you've either caused or allowed to befall them. Oh, man! I'm gonna have to undo all that bitch-assness all over again. I'm gonna need so many grenades. Oh, God. Mine are gonna need so much therapy. <laughs> what the hell is going on? Ah, seems like Class 1B has found my surprise grenade. Nothing like some good old explosives to wake you up in the morning. Well, cheerio. <laughs> There they are! Class 1A. 
Let's fuck them up. Are you sure that's them? That don't look like the same class. Has to be them, stupid. Why else would Eraserhead be with them? <laughs> Good enough for me. What's up, motherfuckers? <laughs> oh my God! Sir, what do we do? Who the fuck are you talking to? The fuck you mean? What do we do? Light they ass up. Irresponsible as fuck! We're kids! This is some grade A trauma. You can't get anywhere else. None of y'all have the balls to just rush in with no regard for your lives. Can't believe I'm saying this, but I miss Midoriya. Jiggy, this ain't 1A. This is some great value version of 1A. I don't see my boo Izuku anywhere. Look, this ain't 1A. Where the fuck are they? And breathe. Try to relax all the muscles in your body. Ah! This is so fucking stupid! My head feels so light. That's because there's nothing in it, Duracell. Just shut up! <sighs> I needed this so bad. I'll bet. Mental health is important. Whatever is outside this classroom, it can wait. Oh, where we go? Ah! Guys, why? Oh, where we go? Ah! So I'm sure you've probably heard by now. Class 1B got attacked by the League of Villains. Apparently the League saw Eraser with them and assumed it was you. <laughs> Man, that's not funny. The fuck it ain't. You may have also heard that Aizawa had to go to the hospital due to injuries sustained while protecting Class 1B. But he is awake and he texted me. I'm fine, thanks for asking. Maybe if your kids weren't so fucking useless, I wouldn't have had to put the entire team on my fucking back and save their soft behinds. <laughs> That's great. Yeah. Well, I'm still your teacher. Class 1B is probably going to have to get a sub until Aizawa gets better. Oh, y'all really thought a little traumatic brain injury and a few broken bones could do shit to me. No! <laughs> Only bitch babies stay in the hospital more than three hours. Whose phone is ringing? Cut that shit off! There's no phone ringing. Yeah, I know. But I've been meaning to thank you for leaving me hanging back there. Oh, no! Three live grenades! <laughs> I can't I miss my All right, guys, good morning. Grab a donut and we'll get started with class. So, am I the only one who's loving this teacher swap? Oh, you mean Aizawa not scaring the shit out of us every day? Yeah, I'd say it's going good. We've got fucking donuts, bitch! Well, every teacher has their strengths and weaknesses. But yeah, this is pretty nice. Yeah, until recently I had no idea that not being stressed was an option. I hear Aizawa throws grenades at them every morning. Damn! He only does that like twice a week with us. Hey, speaking of grenades... Where's Bakugo? So basically, that's why sleep is completely overrated. Only the weak require eight hours. Oh, who texted me? Okay, no-name brands. I'll be right back. Don't touch my mini bar. I don't know if I can do this much longer. How does 1A deal with his crazy ass? I don't know. Where did he get all these grenades? Hey, you got what I asked for? Yeah, 47 grenades. Perfect. I miss you. What? What? I didn't say anything. Okay, so it's been a few days since the teacher swap. I just want to check in on you guys and see how's everything going. <laughs> Interesting. Absolutely fucking tragic. Ooh, -hoo. drama. I didn't see that coming at all. Vlad, why don't you go first? Okay, class 1A is the jumpiest, most traumatized group of 15-year-olds I've ever fucking seen. It's like teaching a class of war veterans. These motherfuckers need therapy, especially Midoriya and Bakugo. What is their deal? Hmm, interesting. Aizawa. Okay, you see when Vlad says traumatize, what he's trying to say is well fucking trained. Unlike class 1B, who are a bunch of bitch asses with no fight or flight response. Not one of them has had a life-threatening injury yet. I'm thinking about just dropping them off with the League of Villains, just to force them to grow a pair. Mmm, I mean Vlad, your kids kinda are bitches. Told you. What? Honestly, I think we should keep this going. We're learning so much. This is the messiest, most genius thing I've ever fucking done. <laughs> okay, guys, it's test day. Y'all ready? Yep. <laughs> All right, guys, let's roll out. Wait, hold up. Where are y'all going? You said it's test day. We're going to where the test is. I have the test right here. What? A fucking written test on paper? Why don't we just do macaroni art? I mean, I like macaroni art. That's because you're this many, jackass. Okay, by now, I am so afraid to ask, <clears throat> what the hell do you guys usually do for a test? Okay, so let me get this straight. You want me to fight all these kids at one time? Yes, that is correct. What? Are you kidding me? He's the number one fucking hero. Yeah, and when my class fought him, it was just Midoriya and Bakugo. Since y'all have less talent than is in their hair follicles, it's going to take all 20 of you. Eraser, I... Listen, man. Midoriya ain't here. There's no one here you care about. So you can go ape shit. 
Y'all got 30 seconds.